So day two, and you can see the caps rising up now. The CO2 is starting to uh, get it moving. Temperature in the cap's about 20, but we'll give it a plunge, and uh, we'll see where it ends up. So what you'll notice as we're plunging is that uh, a lot of gas is starting to come out. See, it's a, see how the caps just drop down here a hell of a lot more than it uh, did last time. Uh, the yeast are really starting to kick in now. You can really smell the CO2 in the morning when you lift the lid. Well, it's not really smell it. You can just uh, get that sensation of fizz in your nose. See, so it's starting to get a bit more bubbly with the action of the, uh, the yeast. So, from this point on, it's going to start to really build temperature and uh, start to chew sugar. And we'll uh, continue to need to plunge this three times a day to make sure all the skins are allowed to uh, mix in with the liquid and that can extract the colours and flavours and tannins from them. And uh, at the moment it's uh, doing that in a relatively cold way, it's only at about 20 degrees. And uh, Mostly a liquid way, uh, a water water extraction, but later on in the ferment it'll become an alcohol extraction. As the yeast uh, chew up their bugs, up their sugar, should I say, and convert it to alcohol and carbon dioxide. So, yeah, it's starting to look good. I'm, I'm enjoying the aromas coming off it. We'll just continue to do this a, a few times a day. You can see the uh, caps drop quite considerably now that I've knocked all the CO2 out of it. See all the water, well not the water, the, the juice mixed in with it there. They're looking good. We'll recheck the temperature now because the temperature gets quite a lot hotter in the cap typically than in the liquid and see where it's at. And, uh, Probably grab a little sample too and have a taste, check out the sugar. I've got my little assistant winemaker here giving me a hand this morning. Go and get your shoes on, please. Go get your shoes on. Daddy's doing something. Yeah, a nice jug of fermenting juice there. See the carrots picking up. But, uh, Okay, so she's dropped quite considerably now. It's actually down at uh, 12. Uh, so it's actually chewed uh, about 0.7 of a bone of sugar overnight. Cook suck on the sauce. Yeah, starting to try get that sense of velocity coming through. So yeah, all progressing well. Quick wash up and we're done.